This is Twit. AMD announced earnings. Um, you know, Intel, obviously the PC makers will be coming soon. But the interesting thing to me here is that the majority of their revenues are now coming from data center, you know. Interesting. Um, yeah. Do you think the, it's just the, because you because everybody else is out of stock that they had? Oh, like, yeah. <laughs> okay. I mean, that's fine. I mean, if, yeah. I, look, there's a reason Burger King exists. Yeah. <laughs> you know, um, that's not a bad place to be. But no, no. You know, I mean, number, two, number two makes a lot of money. Like, there's no two ways about it. These guys are doing just fine. But there's yeah. so much pressure to expand it, clouds right now. I wonder if you get the CPUs you can get. There's nothing wrong with AMD CPUs. Arguably, they do better cloud workloads than just about anything. Yeah, Microsoft mentioned the silicon, like CPU, GPU, MPU, whatever they're using in their own data centers in their earnings. And they specifically called out AMD, NVIDIA, and then themselves, right? Because they're right. doing their own things. Um, I guess it was twice as big. I'm sorry. It's about $2.8 billion from data center, uh, $1.5 billion from the client group. That's mm. desktop, uh, you know, computers, right? PCs. Um, and then what used to be the big thing for back when it was Radeon uh, gaming revenues, it fell 59 percent to uh, 648 million you know um, what you don't see in their play at all ai yeah so well uh yeah i i bet if you well except that the gpus they're selling to the data centers are used for ai right like that's that's ai you know so in, in some sense you could see them as a kind of a mini in nvidia but they also have this pc play which i think nvidia might have soon again as well yeah. in the cpu sense right i know they yep. make Video, uh, video but cards. Paul, don't you think all of the vendors will be pursuing putting NPUs and PCs from now on? It's such a vital part of our workflows. Well, I I, I sense sarcasm there, but no, no. <laughs> but uh, but yeah, I mean they are of course right. So today actually, I AMD hope they are. I think I think somebody have enough nerve to say, hey, we'll do this when it actually does anything useful. In the meantime, you're wasting your money. You can save it buying AMD. Oh. Well, I mean, so their next generation PC processors started launching today, the mobile versions, the yeah. desktop versions were pushed back a couple of weeks. Um, but these are the, I think it was 50 tops. Uh, all right. So MPUs they're, they're on the in. MPU bandwagon. They're so in all of us can have, it doesn't matter where you go, you're going to buy an additional processor. It doesn't do anything. Well, it's, it's just a processor. So it's just a part it's of the, the processor. Third it's not one, doing yeah, anything. The third one yeah. in each of these. Yep. <laughs> um, yeah. So yeah. anyway, they're doing okay. Um, okay I'm glad they're doing well. I don't think they're going to rock it up like NVIDIA. Let me get in. Well, see, I mean, NVIDIA's already, I rocket mean, going these days. Yeah. Yeah. We need, an, we need a number two. So I'm glad they're doing something. I think it's a good business for them to, to play in. Oh. Um, I also think it's an unreasonable comparison, a GPU manufacturer versus a CPU manufacturer. Okay. I mean, they make GPUs. I, I, I hear. Yeah, it. that's not what they're known for. Yeah, right. Um, yeah, but I think that maybe this is part of that shift. Um, but we'll yeah. see. I don't know. I guess. Hey, it's me, Leo Laporte. I hope you've enjoyed this little snippet from Windows Weekly. If you want to see more and want to catch the whole show, you can subscribe in your favorite podcast client or visit our website, twit.tv slash WW. And of course, there's links right below me.